Hey guys, welcome back to a new video. Today I'm going to be testing out one of the best scout rifles in the game, in my opinion. Now I've not tried this out in a very long time, but we did manage to get it like a year ago. And a lot of people have been requesting this in the comment section, so we are trying out the Randy's throwing knife. Now it comes with fluted barrel, extended mag, and you do have quite a few choices to go with. You have rapid at Zen moment, but for me I prefer snapshot kill clip. And it does come with a max range master work and we have put a backup mag on this so we're going to be testing it out and now a lot of you have said also to a uh, shotgun in a video so i thought why not from the shotgun considering we are using obviously a scout rifle but the like goal of today's video is going to be 50 likes so hopefully you guys can smash that because on last video we did set it to 50 and you guys absolutely like literally got it within the first day so i do really appreciate the support I'm going to be jumping into some control. Like I said, remember to subscribe if you guys are new. It does really help out the channel. And like I said, that 30k montage has been complete now. So we're literally just waiting on hitting that 30k milestone. So if you are not subscribed, remember to help out for that. But yeah, when we jump into a game, I'll see you then and we'll test out this weapon. Right, we are on Bannerfall. It's actually a decent sort of map to test out this weapon. Now I've not really been playing Destiny 2, I know I said this in the last video, I've literally just come on to sort of make these videos and keep you guys up to date. And uh, I may try and get back into it, but with all the cheaters and everything going off, I've just not really had the patience to sort of play Trials. I think the last week I played Trials were like three or four weeks ago, so the game, obviously I still enjoy it, but I can't play as much as I used to. And I know I have stopped streaming and that, but until the game fixes its problems, I probably won't be streaming. Because I just simply can't sit there for that long playing this game. Now I'll try and keep the videos entertaining. This is why I've been spending a lot longer on the videos. Because if I'm not playing as much, obviously I've got more time to make the videos and make them a lot better. And you guys seem to love, obviously, the new videos that have been coming out with the editing and all that. But yeah, we're trying out this shotgun as well because you guys always say I snipe too much. So there we go. Now it does this sort of um, scout rifle with kill clip, as you can see, 63 to the head. One of the best scouts in the game by far. It's fully auto as well, so you can literally just fire this thing off. And pretty much at every range, it's going to be good. There we go, we got that. Let's try and get kill clip activated. Let's pick this up quickly. One thing that's good, obviously, about scouts is you can challenge them snipers if you need to with it. Even up close, this thing is a really good sort of weapon. Obviously, you're going to get outgunned, but like there, as you can tell, uh, with this gun, you're going to be getting a lot of kills, especially if you can get that kill clip propped. Now, we've got the worst heavy on for some reason, and I've just died because of that. Ah, <sighs> shit. I do this every video. Have I got a wall cliff on? I do have one, so we're going to put that on. I, ha I literally have a grenade launcher on, and I never get kills with my heavy. Oh, my aim. You can tell I'm not used to shotgunning. Right, we got a few. But yeah, let me know your thoughts and opinions, obviously, on this weapon. Well, for me, a lot of people compare it to the Mida. Now, the disadvantages, obviously, of this one is... Um, Probably the range, the Midas probably got a better range uh, and a lot less fall off damage, I would say. Uh, but the only fault is that's an exotic, so you're pretty much giving up an exotic, whereas with this, you can actually use it. And I do think with this being full auto, 
it makes it a lot better than the Mida, but that's just my opinion. Let me know if you guys prefer the Mida or this. But for me, this is definitely one of the best scouts in the game. Remember to leave suggestions on what you want to try out for me to try out next. I know we got a lot of comments last video and I've checked them all. And uh, I've got a few ideas in mind for a couple videos. But remember to always leave suggestions because they do obviously really help. Now I'm going to try and play on this tether if we can. Not sure where everybody is or the spawning here now. But as you can see, the range on this thing is crazy. Is all the team camping or? Right, where are you? I can see him on the minimap. My shotgun, it just choked. Honestly, it just choked. What the fuck? I pressed my trigger and it didn't fire when I pressed it. No way. That guy just got played so bad. I've just solo tethered him. I feel bad, but I think I had to there. Uh, Another one. Oh, he's super one. Get back. Oh my god, get off me. I thought we were going to die there, to be honest. No. Ran into, like, literally the spawn. Look at all them. Imagine if they were all clumped up like that and we had that wall cliff. <sighs> Should have, uh, if we had kill clip. The thing with kill clip, a lot of people ask me, is kill clip better than, uh, obviously, like Rampage and Swashbuckler? And for me, it's not. Just because for a situation like that where you can't reload, like if we would have had a Rampage or something like that on that, we would have easily killed him, that were a good nade, I couldn't dodge. But yeah, like Rampage and uh, Swashbuckler are a lot better. In PvP anyway, PvE, you probably are, I don't know, you know, to be fair, I think they are better in general. Kill Clip obviously lasts longer, but just for them situations where you really need it and there's two enemies, I think Rampage is better in my opinion. As you can tell, I don't know how well we've done this game. I think we've done okay. That guy just blew himself up. Right, this game is coming to an end. Uh, not a bad game though. Like I said, I've not really been playing. So the gameplay isn't as good as usual. But we got a few nice, obviously, clips with this, showing it off well. And uh, we did get a few shotgun kills, so we can go back to the sniper, thank God, uh, for next video. Let's have a look what we did. 39 kills, so still a decent game. 2.79 efficiency, you guys can't see that, but we did get a 2.8. Yeah, 39 kills, not bad. Like I said, they are usable scout rifles. I'll rate it a 6 out of 10. And that's just because, obviously, it's a scout rifle. Pulse rifles are better, uh, autos are better, and obviously a hand cannon probably can outgun it at decent range. But yeah, definitely the best scout rifle in my opinion. Let me know if you guys disagree. Remember to leave a like. The like goal of today's video is 50 likes. And as always, guys, I will catch you in the next one.